again, it's so good to see you guys. My name is Leah and I want to welcome you to the fourth and final week of our teaching series, Toy Box. Do you guys have a toy box? I had a toy box when I was little and I drew all over it with crayons, which was not a very good idea. This week, we're learning about how God can make us strong. Have you guys ever tried to do something really hard, like learn a new skill or talk to someone new? Well, God can help us be strong and do the things that we need to do. We'll learn more about it in this week's video and I'll see you guys after. There is nothing, nothing impossible. No, there is nothing, nothing too difficult. Because you're with me, you're with me. I am not afraid. Nothing is too hard for you. from around the clubhouse. And look, I'm so strong, I can hold this teddy bear and this robot. Look at all these toys I can hold. And more, and more, and more. Look at me, I'm so, so strong. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, well, maybe I'm not that strong. Who? Ooh. Hey, it's Ollie. Hello, Manny. Who? Who? Picking up the toys, are you? I am Ollie. I'm super strong. 
and can pick up all of these toys. Your arms can hold a lot of toys, it's true. But there are other ways to be strong, too. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. One more twist ought to do it. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, hola, friends! I'm Luis, the handyman. Look at this. It's an awesome weight rack I just finished putting together. See? You can put the weights on it to store them. <laughs> Lifting weights can make you strong. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Speaking of strong, that reminds me of a story. Do you want to help me build it? Great, let's put it on the store fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer. Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now, we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. Today's true story from the Bible begins with a king looking everywhere for the most beautiful woman to be his queen. The king had his people search and search to find the perfect queen. Well, guess what? They found her. Her name was Esther. The king was so happy that they found her and they got married. Then, there is this guy. His name is Haman. He worked for the king, but he did not love God. In fact, he had a plan to do something very mean to Esther's family. One day, Haman told the king that he should get rid of a whole group of people, God's people. When Esther heard this, she was so upset. The king didn't know that Haman's plan would hurt Esther's family and friends. Esther knew she could not let this happen. Esther loved God with all her heart, but going to the king to ask for his help would be scary. She knew she might get in big trouble for going to see the king without being invited, but Esther knew God was with her and that he would make her strong. So Esther asked the king if he would come to dinner. Then at dinner, Esther was strong enough to ask the king to stop Haman's mean plan and save her family and friends. The king said yes! He would save Esther's family and friends. God helped Esther be strong and courageous, and that saved the people. God was with Esther, and that helped her be strong. And God can help you be strong, too, because he is always with you. <laughs> hey there, Ali. Tell me, who is always with you? God is always with me. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who is always with you? God is always with me. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you later. Adios! So there's your story, and it's all true. God helped Esther be strong, and God can help us be strong, too. Thanks, Ollie! Goodbye to you. Hoo! Hoo! Wow! God helped Esther be super strong and do the right thing. I think I got the story. Did you get it? You could say got it. Get it? Got it! Good! Using my arms to hold all these toys isn't the only way I can be strong. God can help me be strong on the inside, too. Stay strong, everyone. I'll see you guys next time. God to help us. 
2 Chronicles 32, 8. We have the Lord our God to help us. 2 Chronicles 32, 8. I did, and I definitely feel like God can help me be strong. Will you do the memory verse with me? We have the Lord our God to help us. 2 Chronicles 32 verse 8. Awesome! Now will you fold your hands and close your eyes with me so we can pray? Dear God, thank you for everything you've given us and for loving us no matter what. Please help us to remember that we can call on you whenever we need to be strong and that you're always there with us. Amen. Awesome. Now remember, God made us, God loves us, and Jesus wants to be our friend forever. All right. Bye, guys.